That was a hoot. Spunky. Rocco's Modern Life. Rocco's Modern Life. <laughs> Hi, I'm Andre. I'm a black nerd. And I want to talk to you about some really cool news that came out. I talked about it on my Twitter and some of you were a little confused about it. So maybe you did not hear. So I want to make sure that you are very aware of what's going on. Nickelodeon announced they are making a brand new Rocco's Modern Life TV movie. Yes! <laughs> I know you all were excited about your Hey Arnold the Jungle movie and that's great. I'm happy for you. I even talked about it on my YouTube channel, but but this, this, yes! <laughs> I am so stoked. So I am a big fan of Rocco's Modern Life. You see, I got my Rocco's Modern Life t-shirt. I got the complete series on DVD, the Rocco's Modern Life complete series DVD from Shout Factory. I always loved Rocco's Modern Life. It was the fourth Nicktoon. So Doug, Rugrats, Ren and Stimpy, that started the whole Nicktoons thing, which actually they just celebrated their 25th anniversary yesterday, August 11th. 25 years ago was when those three shows premiered on Nickelodeon as the first ever Nicktoons. It was so awesome. I remember watching it Sunday morning because <laughs> I was all cool. I was like, Sunday morning cartoons. I've had Saturday morning cartoons, but Sunday morning cartoons on Nickelodeon? This is awesome. Love those shows. And those are the original Nicktoons, but I always personally throw Rocco in there too. Rocco was just a special show to me because those were the four Nicktoons that I watched the most. Doug, Rugrats, Ren and Simi, and Rocco's Modern Life. The other ones, IRL Monsters, Hey Arnold, Wild Thornberries, all of those, I've seen episodes of them, but those four, those first four were the ones I watched the most. And I really loved Rocco because I felt like Rocco's Modern Life had the humor like the crude humor of Ren and Stimpy, but it also had some of the smart writing of Rugrats and would have simple, just everyday adventures like Doug. Yeah, it kind of was a blend of those three because you could have these really normal situations that Rocco would have to deal with, like finding a date or, or doing laundry or, or, or just getting on an airplane, but they would just get to these absurd types of situations. And then of course you had Rocco's friends, you had Heifer and who was an adopted cow with a bunch of wolves. You had Filbert, the really neurotic turtle. You turn the page, you wash your hands. I'm nauseous, I'm nauseous. <laughs> you had Spunky, Rocco's loyal pet companion who just ate everything. And of course you had the big heads, Ed and Bev Big Head, who were voiced by the same person, Charlie Adler. I always thought that was really cool. Oh, Rocco, oh, Ed, come to bed, Ed. Leave me alone, Bev. <laughs> yeah, I just always loved those characters. It was just a really cool show. It was absurd, it was weird, it was funny. There were a lot of jokes in it that I didn't get when when I was younger that when I watch it today, I'm like, oh wow, how did they get past Nickelodeon censors with that one? It's a really good show. If you have not watched Rocco's Modern Life, you will really appreciate it. It's just this really fun show that plays with normal things that happen in our real life, but taking them to a very absurd level. Oh man, so they are making a one hour TV special, Rocco's Modern Life. The original creator, Joe Murray, who worked on the original series is coming back to work on this special. They haven't mentioned anything about the voice cast yet, but I'm really hoping, I'm assuming they're gonna bring the voice cast back to the voices for this. But yes, they are making a brand new Rocco's Modern Life, which I'm really excited about because Rocco's Modern Life was about modern life. And so I think there's a lot of things that have happened in our society that is so different from when Rocco's Modern Life was originally on that Rocco's Modern Life could really play around with and have some fun with. Oh my God, just to see Rocco, Heifer, Filbert, and, and Bev Big Head, uh, all that conglomo, <laughs> oh, go back to O-Town and uh, get some food at the Chokey Chicken, <laughs> you know? <laughs> Or uh, what's the nurse name, the nurse that Philbert was dating, but she had like the hook for a hand and they would get together and they go, sometimes when they're like, they're about to start a musical and someone will always crash their car every time they go, sometimes. <laughs> Wacky deli, yeah! Wacky deli, yeah! And spring cleaning, uh, you know, the, the musical spring cleaning, spring cleaning. I used to sing, uh, you can't fight city hall all the time. You can't fight city hall. You can't fight corporate America. They are big and we are small. You can't fight fight city hall. <laughs> yeah, man, I love Rocco's Modern Life, so I'm really super stoked. I hope they do this right. I hope they bring the, the same style and humor of Rocco's Modern Life. They don't tame it. Because like I said, that show, that show was edgy. They got some stuff past the censors that I was like, wow. So I hope they don't tame it too much and keep that style and humor that Rocco's Modern Life has always had, but do it obviously for the new things that happen in the world and that they can play around with and have some fun with. And I hope the special is good. I hope it does well. I hope they want to make more specials or maybe even just bring the series back. I mean, Rugrats came back like 15 times. So why can't Rocco come back for once? <laughs> and I'm pretty sure it's only a matter of time before we hear about Rugrats doing something new again because you can't stop them Rugrats. Reading Stippy, I don't know because you know the whole John K thing and then Doug, I don't know because Disney. 
Disney. Le let Doug free. Hashtag free Doug. So let me know if you're excited about a Rocco's Modern Life movie or TV special. I'm super stoked about it. And are there any other shows that you wish would get a comeback that would return from your Nickelodeon past? Thank you so much for watching. If you are new here, tickle that subscribe button. I love you like a play cousin. I'm Addy 5000 Chain Chomp Yomp. YouTube day is a very dangerous day.